Hi, welcome to this tutorial on the basics of how to create video in Windows Movie Maker 2012. I'm Gary Smith and I've already double clicked on add, fit, add videos and photos to open this window. Here I'm going to click on the video file to be used in this tutorial. Open the file and it begins processing. It will take some time, though while it's doing that, I can add a title slide. Clicking on the title, normally you wouldn't see this text, of course. I'm going to open a document file, do a copy and paste. And while I'm here, I'm going to set the text duration. I'd like it to be a little longer, 9 seconds. Double click on the title slide and also change that duration to 9 seconds. Now I'm going to add the music file. Add music. Pick an MP3 file. I've already gained permission from the owner to use this file. Double click on the music file and I can set the endpoint which I'd like to be 10 seconds. After I've done the tutorial, I'll go back in and do some fine tuning. We'll set the fade in to be slow, the fade out to be slow. Let's take a look, see how it looks so far. This is your preview window. You click play. I'm going to uh, come back when the processing is complete. Now the video continues to process. You'll notice that the sound wave patterns are starting to show against the image. I've added a, another MP3 file and I want to adjust where it begins in the movie. You'll notice up here there's a start time, a start point, and an end point. This is where it starts within the movie, and this is the point within the uh, music file where it starts and ends. So I want to adjust this to start later in the movie, somewhere in here towards the end. So I'm going to click on the arrow up. You can see in the preview movie, I can tell where that's going to begin. I could also change the number by typing it in. I don't know exactly where I want it to begin, but uh, let's just enter something. Well, that's pretty good. One thing I really enjoy about this, as I mentioned in the article that goes with the video, uh, I'm fairly new to using Movie Maker. I love to get in and experiment as part of the fun of the process. Sure, there are times when I'm redoing that my emotions aren't always pleasure, but overall, I'm happy to be learning as I experiment. Now I'm going to do a fade in and a fade out. And let's preview this. Okay, I'm going to come back shortly to add the ending. I'd like to change the transitions, so I'm going to click on Animations and scroll down to a transition that I like. use this one. Okay, let's put that transition in there. I can also adjust the duration 
of that transition make it longer. Going to the end of the video, and here I'd like to do the same transition and add a credit slide at the end. And you notice this is the default text, so I'm going to open that document again, find my credit text, copy and paste. Adjust the text. Here I can also decide how I want that to appear. Okay, <laughs> double click on the text at the bottom. So let's say I want to do a scrolling up. Yes, that's that looks good. I'd like to see the video which is created here, um, uh, how to give a wonderful foot reflexology session, you can go to that hub. This one is the third in the series. Well, thank you for your time in watching this today, and uh, I wish you well in creating your own video project.